Jake was given his name due to his due to being due to having due to being due to being flammable. After his hood catching on fire, one of his fires. You see, what happened was it was the first day. Everything was going fine when he had a, when he had to put but when it was his first emergency. He rushed to the rescue, went to the building, and got fire on his hood. He jumped out screaming, screaming like there was a screaming terribly. It everyone called him Blank. Which, which he'd start to like get used to. He also met after it worked. He was asked to train another firefighter called Tank. Tank was a Tank is a Tank was a heavy duty in the sense fire on the road move fire hydrant. He also has two water cans in case there's a fire right away, but he was told not to. Lang helped him out, which they were both good friends. Until they, until one day, they were trying to put out a fire until it until it collapsed. They had to call in for backup from the other from some of the other stations. They were fired up. <laughs> Get fired out, fire. Not a good joke. They were later, two, three weeks later, they were later hired by Chief Stan, who were sent the car, who came, who, was, who came, went to Car City. Originally, but, found them, originally they found their way to Car City. In a way. Chief Stan, they saw Chief Stan looking for a firefighter, so they went to Carter City. So that's what really happened. <laughs> they, uh, Lank was was featured in the Great Fire, putting out uh, putting out several fires with with two of the chiefs, Chief Stan and Chief William and William. Lank was was. was we don't really know what happened to Flank after that. Flank was also seen on a Wilbert's one on Wilbert's interview show. In fact, all the firefighters in seventy eight were interviewed, including eighty seven. So that's that's the background of Flank.